Hey, what's up guys? It's Sam here. How are you guys doing today? We guys are having a fantastic day today. We're going to be doing race 22 of 36 from Richmond International Speedway for the running of the Toyota Owners 400. Uh, yeah, so we just finished Talladega. We finished 21st there. And I think, we, yeah, we lost the points lead by 10 points. So that's not good. We need to regain the points lead. We need to regain the points lead here if we want to win the championship. So, uh, um, settings, I'm going to change it probably to hard difficulty or, uh, hard, uh, driving aids for this race. I don't know though. We'll see. Custom difficulty, 100%, uh, full damage, DNFs are disabled, but we've already gone over my DNF procedures and shit. Uh, 25% race length, 4X. Normal, normal, strict yellows, single race stage, quick qualify, yes, sir. So let's, 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 let's go, baby. Let's go, motherfuckers. Ha, motherfucker. Ruff, 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 ruff. Mew, 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 mew. Fuck baseball, man. Well, not fuck baseball. Fuck the MLB. That's what I mean. Baseball is awesome. The MLB is not. MLB has canceled the first two series of the season. Motherfuckers. Opening day is canceled. Um, and at least the first two series. So I think that's like six or seven games. Depending on your schedule. You know. So yeah. We are going to change this. You know, I'll try, I'll try qualifying on expert, and then we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, we're gonna try on expert for a little bit, and then if it's just too much... I think we're going to have to change it. <laughs> 29th. Yeah, I think if we did... I think if we had done hard, it would have been way better than 29th. So yeah, we're going to switch to hard. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. Switch to hard. We need to not fuck around. We can't have any more bad finishes. We're in a championship battle here. I mean, we still got... What? This race 22, so we still got 14 races left, but... You know, you don't want to take any chances. You don't want to take any chances. And, you know, I think after this Let's Play, I'm just going to say fuck it. Let's do another one. <laughs> Let's do another fucking... I like doing these. They're just easy. That's the reason I do them. It's just because they're easy. <laughs> fucking... Well, they're easy and I do actually enjoy doing them. Like, I wouldn't do these if I didn't enjoy it. The only thing is, people don't watch these. That's the shitty thing. Nobody watches these videos. Besides Jaden. Jaden, are you watching this video? If you're watching this video at this point, say, I was watching this video on lap three. Say that. In the comments. And if you don't say it, then that means you didn't watch. I am feeling so much better with life now. Just everything is so awesome. Well, not everything. You know. I, I work at Dairy Queen. But hey. I work at fucking Dairy Queen, bro. That's some good ass shit. You know. I think you could look at life two ways. You could be like, fuck, I work at Dairy Queen. Or you could be like, hell yeah, bro, I work at Dairy Queen. It's like, yeah, I'm not gonna fucking lie and act like it's a good job. But hey. You know. 
I make my money. There's some cool people there. And I get fucking discounts on blizzards and shit. You know? And sometimes I just take food without asking. And, well, even though the managers see me do it and they never really care, you know, I, I still do it without asking. <laughs> One time I just made myself a cheeseburger and ate it right in front of my boss. And I didn't even pay for it. And he just was, he didn't even care. <laughs> Sorry, BJ. Sorry, Tyler. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's... Okay. He saved it. Oh, and fuck. Ruff, <laughs> 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 There goes coal. There goes coal. <laughs> no caution yet? I guess no caution for that. How is that no caution? Man wrecked. <laughs> Man fucking wrecked and you're gonna tell me there's no caution? He's still wrecked. He's just sitting on the fucking edge of the track. Like a dumbass. And everyone's slowing down for him, but they're not pulling a... I have strict yellows. I have strict caution flags on. Man went a lap and a half down. Almost two laps down. <laughs> Fucking... Great officiating. This reminds me of a real NASCAR officiating. Raining in New Hampshire for six laps. No one does shit. Oh, guess what? There's a wreck. Oh, why is there a wreck? Maybe because there's rain. Fucking idiots. And now Cole Custer has to go a whole other lap around just because he missed pit road. <laughs> it's always funny. I always love when that happens. When a driver misses pit road like an idiot and then they have to go around a whole other lap. How many laps down is our friend Cole? Three. Oh, we got a repair. 35th? We fell back that much just from a four second repair? God damn, bruh. And there's the points, uh, the points leader. Uh, it's probably because a lot of people stayed out. Yeah. I'm recognizing a lot of these cars that I'm racing around, so. Here's the points leader. We need to finish 10 spots ahead of him to tie him again. Or I think 5th and... He finishes 5th, we win. I think that ties it. Is Cole out of the race? Is that Cole who's DNF'd? Yeah. Dude, I'm starting to hate the fans who say, like, if you watch NASCAR for the Rex, you're not a real fan. It's like, bro. Fuck off. <laughs> First of all, go fuck yourself. And second of all, go fuck yourself again for good measure. And third of all, um, fuck you. <laughs> it's like, don't act like you've never been excited by a wreck before. Wrecks are cool. 
And, like, I don't watch NASCAR for the wrecks. I watch it for the racing and the wrecks. But, like, if I see a race that goes by and there's not a single crash, I'm gonna be a little bit pissed off, you know? We need something. I feel like if if uh if you go to a race and you don't see a wreck, then you should get twenty five dollars refunded from your ticket. Yeah, cause I mean, for real. Oh shit, there's- is that Ty Dillon? Oh no, that's, uh, Chad Fincham. Ruff, 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 ruff. Mew, 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 mew. Ruff, 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 ruff. Meow, 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 meow. Far the inside. We're having a hard time passing Bowman right here. Probably because our car sucks. Ah. <laughs> 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 Thirty fourth. We work ourselves all the way up there. Ah, 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 oh, man. Well, that'll be our one ten second repair. Yeah, eighteen seconds. Well, fuck. So now, if we have another 10 seconds of damage, we'll have to either do it under green flag or just ride around with that damage and just deal with it. And then if we get it again after that, then we can't repair our damage at all. And we either have to DNF or just ride around with the damage we have. And then 25 seconds of damage means... Automatic DNF. You can't ride around with it. You can't repair it even once. It means you're automatically done. But I don't think that's ever happened to us. You know? Where you've actually decided to DNF. Or I have. Shit, Kyle's leading this race. We're 23rd. We need to go up there and have a good finish. And maybe not have him win this race.
We can get around this pack. Come on, man. Like, these guys are all held up. We can get around them. Fuck off, Curtis. Oh no. <laughs> no, get off the wall. Fucking damn it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I forgot to turn for a second. I almost hit the wall really bad. <laughs> Keep losing spots like that. Harvick is pitting. Pretty much, my thing is, if I'm about the points leader, I'm not comfortable. And, like, even if I am the points leader, I'm very likely still not comfortable. Amarola's not pitting, so maybe he was the reason for the caution. Um, Kevin Harvick's trapped a lap down. Pretty funny. Okay, y'all, if you are still watching this video, I want everybody to comment if you are watching this video at this point. I am watching on lap 52. So I should see two comments. I should see, well, actually, I'm not going to say the other one, because what if you just skip to this part, and then you'll know the other comment. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, say I'm watching on lap 52. I'm feeling so much better though, you know? I feel like in the morning is the worst part for my head. I'm talking about how I feel in my head. Like, I don't feel sick, you know? Like, I'm not sick or nothing. I'm just like, my head feels much better lately. Like, I just feel happier right lately. I started on this pill thing that's supposed to make me happier. I think they're called antidepressants. I don't know what the fucking pill is called, though. They just gave me a pill, said, hey, you want to be happy? Well, then take this. And I was like, okay. And then I did. <laughs> and it's working! Who 
Who texted me? That was my dad. He's telling me not to microwave the shrimp. Yeah, don't microwave shrimp. I learned that lesson one time. I was not happy about it. I went to Olive Garden and I got this like shrimp pasta or some shit. And then I microwaved it the next day because I didn't eat all of it. And then all the shrimp was gone. I was pretty upset because that was the best part. I didn't care about the rest of it. I just wanted the shrimp. You know, Dairy Queen has shrimp now. It's like fried shrimp. I tried one. It was alright. Only two people ordered it today. Oh yeah, was Eric Amarola the reason for that last caution? Yeah, he was. So two Stuart Haas cars are out of this race. I think Harvick's still trapped a lap down, so it's not been a good day for the Stuart Haas cars. Yeah, but he's going to get the free pass. And the other two Stuart Haas, or the other Stuart Haas car, where is he? He's 16th. I'm gonna... I'm gonna fucking pit, dude. And what's the actual, like, fuel mileage that we get? Alright, 27 laps. Which it sucks, because around, like, only 12 laps into the run, it's like the tires just... It's impossible to control the car. My dad's saying that shrimp doesn't explode. I beg to differ. Because one time I put shrimp in the microwave and all the shrimp exploded. Or they just weren't there. Like, all I know is that there was shrimp on the plate before I put it in the microwave and after it came out of the microwave they were no longer there. That's all I know. So, fucking... What happened to it, whether it exploded or disintegrated in the microwave, I don't know. But...
So for people who are wanting to tune into my streams this week, I'll be live for the truck race at 8.45 on Friday. The Xfinity race, I'll be live. When does the fuck does that thing even start? I think it's at 3... Th uh, or I think it's at 4, so I'll be live at... I'll be live 15 minutes before the scheduled start time of the race. That's when I'll be live. And then same for the Cup Series. That's how I am for every race. So the race starts at 3, I'll be live at 2.45. The race starts at 7.30, I'll be live at 7.15. You know? Even though that's technically actually a half hour before it starts because... The, if the race starts at 7.30, it actually starts at 7.45. It's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. Some things will never change. That's just the way it is. The way it is. Hit. Of course I will. Oh, I only fell back five spots because of that. Both ways. Tell me any. Are you okay? Tyler Reddick's leading. Is he going to lead most of the fucking race and then just somehow crash from the lead? Is that what's going to happen again? Is this video game just a, like a remix of Fontana? Which will be the next race in this Let's Play. Coming out probably tomorrow as you guys are watching this. I'm probably going to film that right after this race. That's what I usually do. I, I just sit down and I film like three or four races. That's why I have the date on my videos. So like you guys can see when I'm actually filming this. March 1st at 7.18pm. You can see when I filmed it compared to when it was actually put out. And then it's also a nice little like, oh, what was I doing at this exact moment that Sam was filming this video? Like, if you can think back to, because by the time that you're watching this, it's March 2nd. If you can think back to what you were doing at March 1st at 7, 18 p.m., then you can be like, oh, shit, I was doing this thing while Sam was filming the race. Yeah, just a nice, nice fun thought. Sheena, why are you snoring? I just can't get around anyone, man. I mean, I know Richmond's not the easiest track to pass at, but... Like, damn. I don't like tracks where passing is not easy. Well, I mean, obviously it's not going to be easy anywhere. The, the greatest race car drivers in the world. You know, they're not going to make it easy, but... 
I don't I don't like tracks where it's like the makeup of the track makes it specifically hard to pass. Guys, I have a feeling that this year is the last year with Phoenix as the finale. I don't feel like it'll be the finale next year. I feel like they made an announcement about that. Or maybe it was just a dream that they announced that. I've been having weird dreams though recently. <laughs> I don't mind weird dreams. I'm just like, oh, that was weird. So people have weird dreams or they have bad dreams and it like fucks them up. Me? Not me. Like, I... Here's my thing. I actually like having bad dreams. I like having bad dreams. And here's two reasons why. Because first of all, I think it, it just gets the blood pumping. It's a nice adrenaline rush. It's just, it's fun. It's a nice little adrenaline rush to have a bad dream. And then second of all, you know, you wake up and you're relieved to find out that it's not real. I always hate when I have a good dream. Like, like I want a million dollars. Or... I got the girl of my dreams, and then I wake up and I find out that it's not real, it's always like, okay, fuck you then, you know? But when you wake up from, like, a dream where your family gets murdered, and then you find out that your family didn't actually get murdered, it's like, oh, hey, that's nice, my family didn't get murdered. And it's just, like, a nice little relief. Man, I suck. Man, I suck. Oh, God. I feel like we haven't seen the last caution yet of this race. Even though we are having a decently long green flag run, I feel like we'll still see another caution. Two to go. Battling hard for this 12th place finish. God damn. Final lap. All right, well, there goes True X, and that's the end of the race. <sighs> Fifteenth. Where'd Kyle finish? 
fourth, so he gained another 11 points on us. Not good. Yeah, so... Oh, no, it's just an 11 point... Oh, no, it's a 21 point lead. Damn it. Alright, so... Denny Hamlin wins. Tyler Reddick finishes second. Christopher Bell third. Kyle Busch fourth. Brad Kozlowski fifth. Kurt Busch sixth. Kevin Harvick seventh. Matt Kenseth in eighth. Ricky Sanos Jr. ninth. Matt Benedetto tenth. Clint Boyer eleventh. BJ McLeod twelfth. Sorry, I'm burping. Chase Elliott thirteenth. Chris Buescher fourteenth. I finished fifteenth. Austin Dillon sixteenth. Willie Byron seventeenth. Martin Trick Jr. 18th, Alex Bowman 19th, and Joey Logano in 20th. 21st was Daniel Suarez, 22nd was David Reagan, 23rd was Ryan Priest, 24th was Ryan Newman, 25th was Josh Balicki, 26th was Ryan Blaney, 27th was Jimmy Johnson, 28th was Eric Jones, 29th was Joey Gase, and 30th was Corey LaJoy. 31st was Bobby Carter, 32nd John Arnimacek, 33rd Ross Chastain, 34th Chad Fincham, 35th Michael McDowell, 36th Ty Dillon, he finished a lap down. 37th was Timmy Hill, one lap down. 38th was Quinn Half, one lap down. 39th was Eric Almarola, 53 laps down. And 40th was Cole Custer, 92 laps down. So, yeah. Um, fastest lap was Brad Kozlowski, 29.56. Most laps led was Brad Kozlowski. He led 53 of the 100 laps. So just past half of them. And then on the move, Chris Buescher... Started 37th, finished 14th, and a tough break for Ty Dillon, who started 7th, finished all the way back in 36th position. All right, y'all, I'm going to end this video right here. I want to thank everybody for watching, and peace out.